It is 637. All right, this is a day to be hungry. Absolutely. So much to offer. <laughs> it's amazing what they can do with Geta. It sure is. We hear more stuff <laughs> every year. This is a major tradition for us here in greater Cincinnati. Glear's Geta Fest, bigger than ever. Absolutely. They say this year. Yes, very exciting stuff. WCPO Niners reporter Madeline Oddly live in Newport with what you can expect. Madeline, have you gotten to try any yet? Oh, I already have, Kristen, obviously. I know we're still hours away, but I mean, hey, we get to kick this festival off somehow. And this year, this festival bigger than ever because this time it's going to be spread out over two weekends. And of course, it's a lot more than just get it. We've got a lot of games like this one. I'm going to put the mic down, take a quick little swing here myself. I didn't do very well, but wait, that's wait, okay wait, because uh, there's a reason that we're standing over here. <laughs> I don't need to laugh what right is that, now. There's, Madeline? there's an important you know what, guys, I'm trying really hard. It's six o'clock in the morning. I'm proud. I got to sick duck level out there. <laughs> <laughs> but we've got Carrie Shaw out here because you guys, they, they need more volunteers to help run some of these games. This is a huge festival. Uh, and Carrie, what is it that you're still looking for here? Yeah, so um, all the games here, the proceeds go to charities. So charity groups come in and they help run the games so that, that the kids have something to do when they're here. And this year they're having a really hard time finding volunteers. So we're looking for people that want to come down, have a good time, play some games, play with some kids, just have some fun. Uh, families are welcome. Um, the proceeds go to Dragonfly or if you're have your own charity and you'd like to come down, we have some opportunities for that as well. You guys do this year after year, more than 20 now. I mean, this is so important to the tri-state. What do you think it means to people who come out? You know, the, th the thing with Get It is it's one of those those items that it, it, it it, it's the emotions that come from it. We talk to people and they go, oh, I remember my grandma used to make Geta, or I remember the first time I had Geta. It's something people remember. And when they come here, they get those memories back. And it's just a fun time for them. Carrie, thanks so much. We're going to let you get back to setting up. If you want to come out and enjoy the fun, everything kicks off today at 5 p.m. And uh, remember, this level, 7 here, that's the one you got to beat for now live in Newport. Madeline Ottilie, WCPO 9 News. Okay, so Madeline, you have to beat the 7, and then what do you win now? I, we have to know. <laughs> um, Carrie, Carrie, what do we win? Oh, we have tons of prizes. Yep, tons of prizes. Inflatable dolphins and sharks and all kinds of different things. Uh, yeah, so you can come out and win fun prizes. Yep. There you go. Julie, okay, there very now's good. your chance. You know, we <laughs> ask the hard questions here. It, that's our job. We absolutely <laughs> do the important stuff.